Hi, in the previous tutorial I showed you how to add this sun in the middle of the image here to get this nice effect. Now in this tutorial I will continue with adding this lion in this green grass field and try to make it look realistic like it's really here. So let's get started by first deleting this and then I'm going to open the image you see the image here of this lion next thing I'm going to do is grab the scale tool click click on this chain to keep the aspect ratio type a number click enter and then click scale then with the move tool I'll position it somewhere around here and then I'm going to flip it and next thing I'll do is right click here and add a layer mask use the defaults click add then with the brush tool let's first use big brush big fuzzy brush and a little tip here when you do something like this try to find images that will fit well together or it will be very difficult to make it look like it's really part of the image now I'm gonna zoom in a little bit and reduce the size of the brush Continue painting carefully. Now I'll grab the zoom tool and zoom in really close here. Again with the brush tool. I'll use the bracket keys to resize it. And I'll keep painting carefully here. Now if you go too far like I just did here on purpose, you can switch the foreground and background color, paint with white and unmask the lion. And I'm going to pause here to do this because it will take probably more than 10 minutes to paint around it. So. I finished and now I'm going to zoom in and also hold down the shift key and click here to show you only the lion and you see how I painted over the paws here make it look like they're buried in the grass let's see it one more time paint it carefully around it and some areas of the grass I left over also of the shadow and I think it looked it looks pretty good but it still doesn't fit very well with the image you see this grass is very well uh, green saturated vivid colors and this lion looks kind of too bright it doesn't fit very well with the image so we need to fix that and there are many ways to do this but I'm going to duplicate this layer and use overlay mode and I'm going to duplicate it one more time but before that let's zoom in and you can see before and after I added this second layer it looks much better now but I'm going to duplicate it one more time and this one I'll set the opacity to 20 and you see I got just a little bit more of this effect and now it's pretty much finished you see how it looks without these layer modes and with the layer modes 
so that's basically it for this tutorial and like I said you can try to do this with some of the color tools but with these layer modes it's very fast and easy and this line really looks like it's part of the image here so that's it for this tutorial you can check out the final result in the Facebook page link is in the description visit my channel subscribe if you're new to my tutorials so that's it for now bye